all warmly welcome on SLTV Law. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you a warm welcome once again on SRTV Law. Right now, I would like to show you the ligament of the shoulder, ligament around the shoulder. So when I mean around the shoulder, it's just between the bone of the arm, the scapula, and the clavicle. Good. Those are the ligaments we are going to see today. Stick on this video from the beginning up to the end. Good. This is the posterior view. We start from the clavicle. This is the clavicle. Good. When the clavicle comes, it articulates with the acromi acromion process. Then it makes a joint called acromioclavicular joint. So this ligament here, it is called acromioclavicular ligament. The ligament between acromion process and the clavicle is called acromioclavicular ligament. Good. And here on the scapula, the scapula has a part called coracoid process. So this ligament between coracoid process and the clavicle, that, I mean that connected the coracoid process to clavicle, it's called colacoclavicular ligaments. Colaco caravicular ligament. I have said this is colaco cravicular ligament and this is acromiocravicular ligament. Now there is a ligament co connecting acromion process to coracoid process. That is coraco acromion ligament. So this is the ligament. The one that connects coracoid process to the acromion process. It's called coraco acromio ligament. So, these are the ligament just between clavicle, scapula, just and the one that connect acromion process to the coracoid process. Now let's go to the granohumeral joint or the shoulder joint itself. Good. When we continue the posterior view. Good. You see here is big ligament that fix the humerus to the scapula. So this humerus is attached to the granoid cavity. So the joint is called granohumeral ligament. Granohumeral ligament. And this is the joint capsule or the big ligament that surrounds the joint. This is called the joint capsule or granohumeral ligament. Good. But there is also another ligament that connect a, corac a coracoid process to the humerus. It's called coracohumeral ligament. Good. It's called coracohumeral ligament. The one that connect the humerus to the coracoid process is called coracohumeral ligament. Okay. Good. And here, when you see this tendon, this part moving downward, this one, this is the tendon of biceps brachii. This is the tendon of biceps brachii. Good. Do you see? These are the ligament around the shoulder. Thank you for watching the video. I hope it's very helpful. So please don't keep this information just with yourself share this information to your colleagues and see you in another video next time may god bless you abundantly
please support this channel by placing like, subscribe and the bell. This is a huge support for this channel. May God bless you.